Hello everybody. It's Crazy Mike. Crazy Mike's discount videos. How are you doing today? So, Dick will not be joining us for this one. Currently, I'm recording on the Monday. However, this video is going up on Tuesday, so happy Tuesday. I don't know why I'm doing the accent. It's probably pretty bad and pretty offensive, but I don't know. Today is story time. We're doing some reaction content, eventually. I'm just going to take a moment here, do a quick video, since this is going up the day after I record it. And I'm going to tell you a couple stories about me. Because I can. If you like them, leave a like, leave a comment, subscribe, and share the videos. Share all my videos. You know you want to. They're good. They're fun. It's good shit. And um, so anyways. We're moving to scheduled content, so Mondays, Wednesdays, Fridays, you get video games. Tuesdays, Thursdays, Saturdays, you get other stuff. Tuesdays are going to be... Obviously, this one is going to be story time. Um, we might also do... Like, uh, reaction stuff. Uh, now, Tuesdays are typically going to be reaction days. Once I finish getting everything fully sorted out, I just want to get this started, so I at least get in the habits of making sure that I have what day is this, what day is. But, uh, yeah, so Tuesdays are going to be reaction days. We're going to be reacting to some, maybe some memes, maybe some Reddit stuff. I know uh, Thursday is going to be some Reddit stuff. Should be fun. Um, I'm thinking about doing r slash am I the asshole? Because am I the asshole? It's a good question. You should always be asking if you're the asshole. And if the answer is yes, do something different. Anyway. Story time. So. Let's see here. What's a good story to start with? A uh, good story to start with. I might do two stories today. I might. Maybe. Depending. I know. I know. Story time. First one will be my very first ever trip to California. California. And Disneyland. So, I was about 12. 12 at the time. Wah, wah. That's 14. That. <laughs> 12. No, that's 22. <laughs> there we go. Uh, I was 12. And uh, we, we took a road trip to California from Utah, where I'm at now. It's an eight to ten hour drive. It's not bad. The drive out was really fun. Uh, it was me, my grandparents, my mom, and my aunt. And uh, at the time, my uncle was a rider in the X Games. This was a long time ago. A long time ago. I was 12. That was almost 17 years ago. <laughs> almost. And, uh... It was a summer trip. Which is always fun, right? Nice summer trip. 12 years old, go to California. See my uncle ride in the X Games. It was a lot of fun. Um, so yeah, we did that. Very first day we went was the X Games. Had a great time. I think my uncle took third. And it was a freestyle dirt BMX is what he did. Specifically. Get some hints. I'm sure some people out there could figure out who that was. Or, you know, who my uncle is. I'm not going to name drop because I don't think that that's a good thing to do. I think it's a kind of a garbage. Like, like it just makes you a garbage human. Not really, but, you know. Anyway, first day we, went, we, we, well, we watched him ride in the X Games. It was a lot of fun. Like I said, I'm pretty sure he took third. He was definitely top five, at least. Because he was good. He was really great at what he did. And um, we had a great time. Had some dinner. That was the first day. Second day, uh, we went to the beach. It was actually the second and third days that we were out there. We went to the beach. 
got a hangnail. I'm trying to take care of it. Uh, do I have clippers? I have clippers. I have clippers on a Deadpool lanyard. It's a nice lanyard. I got it from GameStop. <laughs> but, uh, so yeah, second and third days we were at the beach. Which, uh, obviously I'm ginger. And I, at the time, did not have SPF 10,000 sunscreen. So, as I'm sure you can imagine, I got rusty toasty. Like, seriously, I had a second degree sunburn up my back. It was amazingly painful. <laughs> it's bad. I had blisters that big. Horrible. Shut up, Crowley. I love you. And, uh, yeah, it was not a fun experience. I didn't even notice until we, we got back to the hotel on the second night that they were really that bad. Like, they'd been kind of normal. Sunburn, uncomfortable. I think I got, they, they turned into the second degree burns on, uh, on the second day. Which, uh, it was my first time ever to the ocean, too, and all the salt water got in my mouth. Like, really bad. Really bad. And uh, it, it was disgusting, like proper fucking disgusting. And like, if you've never had that much salt in your body at once before, and, and and your body's just like not used to it, it's not a good experience. You will throw up. I did many times. <laughs> I think I grossed out everybody else on the beach. Oops, I was 12. I didn't know better. And at the time, I wasn't particularly scared of the ocean. I think at, at the time, I was having, like, I'm, I'm scared scared of clown kind of stuff, which is pretty normal. I think most people are scared of clowns, right? Or, you know, have some issue with clowns. Unless they are a clown or no clowns personally. Whatever. But so we spent that time at the beach. And get home the second day, and my back's like, oh, my God, oh, my God, my back, my back, my back. It's, it burns, it burns, it burns, it hurts, it hurts, it hurts. And it was not a pleasant evening. We didn't have any aloe vera. We didn't have, any, like, any kind of soothing, anything. So it was just pain all night long. It's a miserable little 12-year-old. The next day, we went to Disneyland. <laughs> like, the, the next day, we went to Disneyland. And it was fun. I actually did have a good time. My back hurt like hell, but I had a good time. And uh, the very first ride we went on was the Haunted Mansion, which a fucking fun ride. And I personally, I really enjoy the uh, Eddie Murphy Haunted Mansion. I thought it was a lot of fun. I still think it's a lot of fun. Nobody can convince me otherwise. Find the key, find the key, find the beautiful key, find the key, find the key, oh, how happy you'll be. Anyway. So, we went on that ride. Was that the first one we went on? No, it wasn't. We went on Indiana Jones. Then we went on Splash Mountain. <coughs> <coughs> okay. So, Indiana Jones, then Splash Mountain, then Haunted Mansion. Splash Mountain was great. A little, little overrated, but it was fun. And uh, then we w then we went on the Haunted Mansion. <laughs> and the Haunted Mansion was is, is a fun ride. I, I, I like the haunted stuff. I'm, I'm, I have a very strong inner goth kid that I am not really allowed to let out because I'm an adult and I need to have a job. <laughs> anyway... <laughs> So we got off the Haunted Mansion, and at the time, like, I had looked up some stuff about Disneyland before we went, because of the stuff I wanted to know, and one of the things I found was at the time, they had, like, one stall cart thing, like, towards the back of the park, and it was the only one that sold, like, bottled water. And my mom wanted bottled water. So I'm like, Mom, the, the, it's like all the way at the back of the park. It's fucking far away. I don't want to do that. Can't you just have like a Diet Coke or something? She's like, no, get me bottled water. I'm like, I can't 
Like, can you at least come with me? Because I don't really want to wander through Disneyland Park alone. Because I don't trust you not to wander off. I didn't say that, but it's kind of what was going through my mind. Is I did not trust her to just, like, disappear and not leave me there. Like, I, I was absolutely convinced that my mom was getting ready to just leave me at Disneyland. And so... We kind of got into a little bit of a, like a... I'm not going to call it like an argument because it wasn't like really anything super serious. But the result is is actually one of my fa personal favorite memories. Like in a big way too. And it, it, it gave me a, a lot of love and respect for my grandfather. Because <laughs> my grandpa's an awesome guy. He really is. Uh, but yeah, so me and my mom were just kind of going back and forth. Don't be a dick. Get me water. Don't be a dick. Get me water. And my grandpa comes in yelling in the middle of Disneyland. <laughs> just like top of his lungs. Don't be a dick. Like just loud and everybody was staring at us. I'm like, mm, am I being a dick? I don't think I don't Am I being a dick? Why can't she just have Diet Coke? I don't know what's going on. I'm 12. <laughs> Don't be a dick. Stop being a dick. And everybody was staring. We went and sat down. We did, we did not end up getting our water. We did actually end up, I think, ending up getting our Diet Coke. And we got some ice cream. Actually, I think it was specifically me and my grandpa went and got ice cream. Uh, we left them kind of at a restaurant. I think they ended up having lunch. But me and my grandpa, for sure, went and got ice cream. And went on Space Mountain without everybody else. And we just had a great time. Because I, I, I don't think, I, I just don't know if I was like actually being a dick or if you just like wanted to, to kind of resolve the situation. But uh, yeah, just loud as you could. Stop being a dick in the, in the middle of fucking Disneyland. Like who does that? I, oh, we were going to go to Mickey Jail. I didn't want to go to Mickey Jail. <laughs> but he took me on Space Mountain and we had a great time. And uh we actually ended up going back one more time the next day. We went on a few more rides. Like those, that day wasn't quite as memorable, but uh, my my X Games uncle joined us, and you know, oh teacups, teacups. Cause I, I wanted to go on the teacups because it's like oh you can spin them and I like spinning. I don't I don't even know why I like spinning. I just like spinning. But uh, we we ended up going on the teacups. And I'm thinking like, I wonder if I can spin this thing so fast. That I make him sick. He's like, dude, I ride in the X Games. You're not going to spin this so fast to make me sick. I did. I was 12 years old and I did. <laughs> like, this dude, like, he really does. He rode in the X Games. Like, he, he up in the air doing tricks on his bike, all that shit. Got on the teacup and I managed to spin it so fast, it made him nauseous. <laughs> like, it's a stupid thing to be proud of, but uh, <laughs> I don't know. We had a good time. To this day, he, he, he does not acknowledge it, but when you know, you know. So, and, and so that's like the, the story of my very first time ever going to Disneyland and California. And Because like everything, of course, with it being in such a short time span really does just together. And, and they're all interconnected, all interinvolved, all that. And it was a great time. It really was overall, like, just a fantastic time. And, yeah. That was my very first trip out of state. I did learn more swear words on the drive than I actually thought I could. Um, mostly from my aunt. <laughs> uh, I, I love her. She, she's great. Uh, we were doing what we called the alphabet game. And... Basically, you would be going in order A, B, C, D, <coughs> A, B, C, D, blah, 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 all the way down to Z, and then back. And you, either, you, you had to find something that you could see from the car window that started with the letter you were on. And so, like, I was on A, my mom was on B, my aunt was on C, grandpa was on D, grandma was on E, so on and so forth. And so, when it was your turn, you had to find something 
that started with that letter, and then you had to find a, you know, a word that started with that letter. And so, A, it was pretty easy. The, I can't remember exactly what I, what, what I had found, but it was like, oh, Apple, and we got down to my aunt, and she's like, see, a uh, car. And I'm perfectly sensitive, it's the, uh, C U N T word that I can't say. Don't want to say. It, it'll it'll get my channel deleted. I've only been, I haven't even been doing this for a year yet. If I'm gonna get my channel deleted, I want it to be worth it. <laughs> Which uh, that word is not. I'm like, what does that word mean? Mom, mom, what does that word mean? No. I'm not telling you what that word means. Grandma, what's that word mean? <laughs> My grandma's up there. Oh, I can't believe you'd say that. My grandpa's just up in the front seat. <laughs> and my mom's just uh, teaching my kid all these words. And yeah, that, that, that was the drive in and out. And wow, this has actually gone on quite a bit. I didn't think it would actually take this long to tell that story, but there you go. That, that, <laughs> That's that's a little bit about me and the happy memories of my childhood. The only happy memories from my childhood. The rest of them were not so great. Mommy and Daddy always fighting. The divorces, the, the beatings. More divorces, more beatings. Mommy and Daddy getting remarried when I fucking told them not to. <laughs> that that's a that's a whole other thing for a whole nother time. Tell you what, if we can get to fuck it, if we can get to one hundred subscribers and one hundred likes on this video, I will tell that story of my parents getting remarried after I told them not to. Actually happened about the same time as I went back <laughs> as I went to Disneyland. So that, yeah, but uh, hey, that is uh, just under twenty minutes on this story time video for you. I uh, hope you enjoyed it. If you did, leave a like, leave a comment, and hey, consider subscribing. And I will probably do maybe one story time a month, depending on what I feel like and all that. And uh, if these videos get watched and liked enough, I guess. Who knows, I might do more, I might do less. I, I might just tell stories as I feel like telling stories. Fuck it. <laughs> anyway, thank you all so much for watching. Again, if you did enjoy it, leave a like, leave a comment. Consider subscribing. And share the videos. I don't think you I don't think people really realize how much sharing the videos actually really does help. But hey, do it. Do it, do it, do it. You want to. You need to. Help me out. And I will see you in the next one. Goodbye.